In this video, I'll be helping you with the Alex problem type called finding the roots of a quadratic equation of the form ax squared plus bx equals zero. So we start by knowing that that is the form we will have to have. And in this example, we're solving for w and w squared equals negative 12w. Finding these solutions, I'll need to put this equation in this form. So to do so, I'll take the w squared equals negative 12w that we're starting with, and we need to set that equal to zero. I can do that here by moving the terms to one side, and since the w squared is already on the left, I can add the 12w to both sides. On the right-hand side, it will cancel, giving me the zero, and that's the form that we were shooting for. And then on the right-hand side, I now have w squared plus the 12w. And to solve in this form, I would first factor out any common factors on the left-hand side. And here they both have a w, so I can factor out a w. And from the first term, I would be left with the other w, that was the w squared, I've taken out a w, and the 12w, if I've removed the w, is now just 12 equals zero. And looking at this, we now have multiplication on the left equaling zero. So if two expressions are being multiplied with the result of zero, that means that either the first expression, w, would have to be zero, or perhaps the second expression could be zero. And all this is saying is that when two things are multiplied, if the result is zero, one of those two things has to be zero. And from here, we already have one solution, is that w could be zero. The second possibility, if I were to solve this for w by subtracting the 12 from the left hand side to isolate the w, that would give me the w by itself equals a negative 12. So this would be a second solution of w equals negative 12.